The biggest events of the year in Orlando is back. It's bringing in an estimated 150,000 people. It's now underway. Of course, we're talking Megacon 2023. Fox 35's David Martin spent the day at the Orange County Convention Center to check it all out. The four-day Megacon and all of its film, TV, comic book, and video game delights is expected to have a $95 million economic impact on Central Florida. Spokesperson Ansley Newland joined us live on Good Day Orlando and says this year's attendance is likely to break last year's of 135,000 attendees. Just come, just have fun. There is something for literally everyone at this show. If you are a fan of film and television, we have an amazing celebrity lineup. If you are a comic book fan, we have a fantastic professional comics creator lineup. If you like to dress up and wear costumes, we're doing costuming programming all weekend long. If you like to show we have a fantastic floor full of amazing merchandise and one-of-a-kind pieces by local Orlando artists. One of the main draws for Megacon is Celebrity Row, where fans can meet their favorite stars, film and TV actor and children's book author Henry Winkler, a.k.a. the Fonz from Happy Days, told us why he loves these events. And they say, I never thought in my whole life I would get to meet you. And I say to them, I had no idea I was going to meet you. Sometimes the men or the women cry at, um, at, at our meeting. And you, if you don't take that in, you are a dead person. Tickets start at $28, available at the door or online. Parking, however, is at a premium. Consider a rideshare service for Megacon through this Sunday. In Orlando, David Martin, Fox 35 News.